latest edition of the Commonwealth Clash proved to be one for the ages on Friday night as UVA and Virginia Tech needed overtime for the first time in the history of the series to settle this one. The Hokies seized early opportunities and jumped out to a quick 14-0 lead at halftime. Despite falling behind late in the game, they had guys step up and make crucial plays like freshman Trey Turner on offense and Emmanuel Belmar on defense. Of course, there was a lot riding on this game and the players gained confidence in coming out on top. It shows us that we know we could be that team. Like we, Of course, we want to be the team to end the whole streak. Like We knew what was at stake, but the, like games like this make us realize that we could be bigger than what we have been in the past. Guys didn't quit. Um, you know, and then just that drive by the offense with Dalton catch and then the fumble. Um, it's just it's just unbelievable stuff. Um, you know, that's two years in a row on senior day we had crazy finishes. You know, last year with Pitt and this year against UVA. Tech also snapped a four-game losing streak with the win. Up next, a matchup with Marshall a week from today for an opportunity to play in a bowl game. As for Virginia, they attributed last night's loss to their inability to score in the first half and protect the ball. Despite having three turnovers with the last one costing them the game, quarterback Bryce Perkins set the single season record for total yards with more than 3,300 and also the record for total touchdowns at 31. Disappointing loss, but the Cavaliers too have confidence as they prepare for a bowl game. Honestly, losing to Tech hurts probably the most. So, I mean, it's just, it's just a heartbreaking loss and we just got to battle back. Just, you know, watch the film, find what we have to work on and move forward.